Organized by three physiologic domains, the 17 MBS IMP components are categorized under either the oral, pharyngeal, or esophageal domain. The scores for each component are explained and demonstrated using representative segments of video fluoroscopy paired with detailed and synchronized animation. Throughout the learning zone, audio provides additional information about the specific score being demonstrated. The learning zone is designed with two media windows that by default function independently. Enlarge the windows by clicking the expand icon. Each window has a set of identical controls. Manage each window by using the pause play toggle, the slider to advance or reverse the video, or move frame by frame with the step function here. Select the padlock icon to lock the screens and view scores using fully synchronized video fluoroscopy and animation. These example pairs were developed to enhance the clarity of the physiology being demonstrated and can be viewed, reviewed, and studied repeatedly. You can track your progress at any time by selecting the View Progress icon. Every score for each of the 17 components must be viewed at least once before access is granted to the training zone. The training zone is divided into two sections, swallow by swallow and full study. The second is locked until the first is completed. In the swallow by swallow section, each component is scored on 20 individual swallows taken from MBS IMP protocol studies. Selecting any number above the media window will take you to that specific swallow. The 17 physiologic components are listed next to the media window. Use the scroll bar to expose all 17. The area below the scoring panel displays the bolus consistency for each individual swallow. Make note of the consistency as this will determine how you score. Hover your cursor above the scoring tips link to reveal scoring guideline reminders for certain components. When ready to score a component, choose the desired component in the list next to the media player and the associated scores will populate to the right. Select the score of choice and submit. Feedback is immediate and states the success of a choice. If correct, move on to the next component. If the score selected was incorrect, the system provides the correct score and the option to view the PDF, MOV, and animation files from the learning zone. The View Training Tips icon will reveal the PDF help document in a separate tab. To return to the training zone, select the appropriate tab above the web browser. The View Tutorial Video icon takes you to the scoring help page, where all scoring help files can be viewed. Select the MOV file under the appropriate component to review component-specific scoring rules, guided practice examples. Selecting the View Score Animation icon displays the score-specific component animation from the learning zone in the Media Player window. Over the course of the training zone, scored components and the success of each are maintained and marked using a system of green checks and red X's. The single swallow studies can be scored repeatedly, providing the opportunity for ample review, study, and practice before moving on to the full study section. Each must be scored at least once, however, before access to the full studies within the training zone is granted. Working within the full studies functions similarly to the single swallow studies. 15 high-resolution full protocol studies are accessible at the top of the screen. The media window and player controls function the same as in the swallow by swallow section. Bolus trials are labeled within the full protocol itself. Passing the cursor over the full study summary link reveals a brief medical history specific to the selected full protocol study. Likewise, hovering your cursor over the scoring tips link reveals scoring guideline reminders for certain components. Choose the desired component in the list next to the media player and the associated scores will populate to the right. Select the score of choice and submit. Feedback is immediate and states the success of a choice. Overall impression scoring rules can be viewed as needed by selecting the OI scoring tips link. Likewise, the help link reveals the component specific help files and a link to the MBS IMP guide for a review as needed. The full protocol studies can be scored repeatedly, providing the opportunity for ample review, study, and practice before moving on to reliability testing. Each must be scored at least once, however, before access to the reliability zone is granted. The reliability zone assesses the learner's ability to successfully capture impairment using the MBS IMP. Ten randomly selected studies are presented to be scored in terms of overall impression. A minimum accuracy of 80% on each of the 17 components is required for successful completion of the reliability zone. Retesting will be required on any components with less than 80% accuracy. For the most part, working with the studies in the reliability zone is the same as in the training zone. There are a few differences, however. After selecting and submitting a component's score, no immediate feedback is presented. There are no green checks or red X's marking the correctness of submitted scores. 
Darkened circles do, however, denote that a component has been scored. In the training zone, once a component score is chosen, it must be submitted. In the reliability zone, however, the scores are not returned to the system until the score for each component in each of the 10 studies has been submitted. At this point, when the scoring of all 10 studies is complete, a new window appears instructing the learner to submit all scores for evaluation and determination of success. Until that icon is clicked, the studies remain available for review and the scores can be changed. This promotes moving through the assessment carefully and at one's own pace and provides the opportunity for additional study and contemplation of scores if needed. Once the submit icon is clicked, the scores are returned to the system in bulk and feedback is provided regarding whether or not reliability criterion was achieved. If the criterion was not achieved, the notification reflects this and also includes general feedback outlining the physiologic areas that would benefit from additional study and review. It is recommended that users enter the scoring help window to review the PDF and MOV help files for each failed component. Additionally, the learning and training zones remain available for review and scoring practice. The reliability zone can be repeated as many times as needed for successful completion. During the retesting, components that have already achieved the passing criteria of 80% accuracy are grayed out. Once a user has successfully achieved the reliability criterion, notification of the success is given and a link is provided to complete a course evaluation and print the certificate of completion. Once the designation of registered MBS IMP clinician is earned, immediate access to the MBS IMP interface for patient management and report generation is provided. The MBS IMP website includes an express report feature that allows clinicians to quickly enter MBS IMP scores into the database and produce an abbreviated report. To access the express report, click on the patient data and reports link on the home screen. Once you are redirected, scroll to the top of the patient record screen and locate the Add a New Patient Express Report link. In addition to the patient record screen, the Express Report link can be accessed through an existing patient's record. When accessed via the patient record screen, the Express Report feature provides the option to generate a new patient ID or search for an existing patient ID. Once an ID is obtained, the patient's year of birth, race, ethnicity, referring physician, reason for referral, primary medical diagnosis, and MBS IMP overall impression scores must be entered before a report can be generated. There are two options for generating a report. The first of the two reports is formatted as a PDF file that can be downloaded to your computer or tablet. Scrolling through the report, you will notice that there is a plot graph image representing the location and severity of each of the 17 MBS IMP physiologic components. The plot graph image is a feature of both the full and express report generators. This image is derived directly from the information entered into the report and complements the descriptive table containing the MBS IMP overall impression scores and nomenclature. Once you have reviewed the PDF file, it can be emailed, faxed, or copied and pasted into compatible electronic medical records. If your EMR does not support images, you can download a rich text format of the report that can then be pasted into the patient's medical record.